hello today i will discuss with you uh, analysis uh, for the assignment 1 to 3 uh, for the course fuzzy set logic and system application in assignment 1 we got 95 percent accuracy in assignment 2 we got 90 percent accuracy in assignment 3 also we got 90 percent accuracy but these accuracy can be a hundred percent and there are minor mistakes which we have to must take care for the final assessment which of the following are not a fuzzy set so correct option are a and b a is not a part of fuzzy set because in this the membership value either one or zero either one or zero therefore it is a part of crisp set and that's why we missed this option and that's why uh, our answer is partially correct and we got only 0.5 marks Assignment 2, question 2. Assignment 2, question 2. A pi shaped membership function is defined by how many parameters? And during the discussion, I already told you that in this question, uh, there are uh, the parameter maybe 2 or maybe 4. There are parameter maybe 2. Uh, in this particular section, there are only 2 parameter exist. Uh, but in this pi function, there are 4 parameter exist. So I already told you that you can opt option A or option B, but I opted option B. That's why it is wrong and they are considering it only two parameters are available. That's why we got less marks in these questions. And this is the minor mistake. Assignment three, question three. Question is that which of the following is not true for the involution property of the for the crypt set in this question i discussed this solution i discussed this solution but the thing is that i am giving the correct explanation but unable to see this word not true not true actually i am uh, considering the for which the involution property hold therefore and double complement of a and double complement of b double complement of A, double complement of B, uh, these both the property exist and uh, but the question being asked is not true. Therefore, uh, this and this are the correct option. That's why this is the uh, um, blunder mistake and uh, maybe you during your submission you have put the correct answer. Uh, that's why uh, we got 90% accuracy in this assignment and thank you so much and I already uh, uploaded the assignment 4 and uh, definitely it will be um, accurate and uh, you can give it will be a uh, give you 100% accuracy thank you